Hey everybody, um, just another little update. Earlier, I was feeling so bad. Um, my pulse ox was 89%. I was having trouble breathing. Um, it was causing me a little bit of anxiety. I called my mom, let her know. I told my son so he would check on me and I definitely had to do his inhaler. Again, I ended up doing it like three or four times. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. I was so fatigued and like I could not move. I was just laying in the bed, like going, why? What's going on? Why is my, why am I having trouble breathing? You know, all this weird stuff. And my son convinced me to go outside. Beautiful day here in Florida. Get some vitamin D. So I just sat in a chair outside still having trouble breathing, raised my arms above my head. I tried to do the pursed lip breathing, which may help some of you out there. A lot of COPDers do it. Um, so what you do is you breathe in through your nose. And you blow out the candles. Nice and steady and slow. And that's to bring in more oxygen into your body, into your lungs, and then per slip breathing, the blowing out the candles, <sighs> removes the, <coughs> excuse me, removes the carbon dioxide in the lungs. So anyway, I was feeling so bad. No lie. I was getting anxiety and feeling scared because I do not want to go to the emergency room because once you're there, I'm God only knows what will happen. And I'm an optimistic person, but I'm also a realist. So anyway, there's that. And then after the inhaler and then like taking, trying to practice my breathing and going outside and raising my arms above my head, trying to expand my lungs so I could breathe, um, I would say at least a good 30 minutes passed and all of a sudden I was hungry. I was like, oh my God, I'm so hungry. So we ended up calling in a delivery uh, for some Taco Bell. And I started eating the Taco Bell and realized that I couldn't taste what I'm eating. I had taste yesterday, um, as far as I could tell. So today, the eighth day of COVID, I lost my sense of taste. I haven't tried my smell yet, but just wanted to give you an update. Um, my pulse ox went up from 89% back to 99% after that 30-minute interval of weirdness that was going on with my breathing. You guys, this is like such a weird, unpredictable virus. I've never, never gone through this, excuse me, before. You, usually, the, the longer you go, you know that you're on your road to recovery. So this has just been really flipping weird. So um, anyway... I can't, I can't taste anything, so there's that. But I am feeling better, and my pulse ox is back up to 99%. So the albuterol inhalers work. I've, it was my son's. He has a, it, it's a rescue inhaler in case, because he has uh, exercise-induced asthma or whatever. Like, he can get ir irritants or irritated or whatever. I might need it. He's only used it, like, maybe once a year or something, so... He had a brand new one that hadn't been used, and so I used it, and it helped. So, all right, guys, I hope everyone is doing well. I I hope and pray that all of us, all of us come through this, and uh, we're only going to be stronger in the end, right? All right. Thank you. Bye.